Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, today we have to keep the volume down a little bit because I moved into a new place and uh, my downstairs neighbor has been complaining that I make too much noise and he literally threatened me if I make noise again. So I can't let that happen. Um, so anyway, I just bought this harmonica. Alright, and with that, let's get into the actual video. Bricklayer Land, the game is out. Let's just go and actually play it. Uh, connect my MetaMask, of course, for sure. Let me put the volume a bit lower, because that might be too loud. Okay. 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 So I do not have an NFT. Uh, if you don't remember that from all the millions of views that my video got. Uh, if you have an NFT, the time is reduced even more. I'm just going to assume no one knows anything about the game, because no one actually watched my other video. So, it's Bricklayer Land. You can buy a level 1, 2, 3, or 4 plot and uh, grow houses, I think. And then just sell the houses. Okay, this might be too loud, even in the fucking thing. Shut up. Okay, so you got the claim button. There is no limit, minimum claim, but I think you can only claim only every 3 days. If you have the NFT, it's every 2 days, I think, or 1. Let's just see what's in the shop. So, you need this for level 1, you need this for level 2, 3 and 4, self-explanatory. How do I buy the lands? Do I just click on it? For 143? No, no, no! Cancel! That's not what I wanted. Shut up. Shut up. For 243, for 500, and for 629. But do you only need one brick? Because I did buy uh, a thousand, almost. And it's 13 for this. 30 some shit for this. And why is the music so fucking loud? Shut up. Uh, I could buy this one, but do I have the... What is this? Why don't I have them in there? Do I have to confirm? Please don't Oh, wait, what? Uh, okay, so you have to buy them separately okay all right well I'm gonna confirm this shit and I'm gonna buy the fields and then I'll be back because in the meantime I'm gonna go get high all right well I have my land okay so I need bricks buy the brick I have to fucking approve everything I'll just probably skip this part you know, it's probably not gonna be in the video. I can move around in my chair and cough and shit, make disgusting noise, because no one's gonna hear it. <coughs> okay. I have the brick. How many do you need? Just one? Oh, okay. So, for one house, it takes four hours, and then you have to harvest it. So, I can buy this shit as well now. So, okay, you have to really approve all the fucking lands. On the level 1 land, you can only build level 1 houses with level 1 bricks. And on the second one, you know, first you can buy, you can build level 1 and 2. And on the 3, you know, all 3, you get, you get the idea, right? Right. And then on the 4, all 4. Now, the thing about this game is that... The return of investment was, what, two days or three days, don't, I don't remember, but somewhere around there, which is extremely low, and it's based on an oracle system, so, I, I guess, it's the same shit, I don't know what to think of oracle systems anymore, I don't know what to think of non-oracle systems anymore, the whole crypto game space is kind of fucking wonky, and the games don't have a, too long of a lifespan, usually. I would say 95% of games uh, eat shit and die after two weeks or a month. So that's why I'm curious about this game, because with a three-day return of investment, uh, it's quite interesting. Because in games like this, and for all of you who remember my other video, how many, how much, how many tokens do I have left? About uh, Top Flower, where it's the same shit, you buy lands and you put flowers instead of houses. Uh, it's basically the same game, I guess, but this one has way faster return of investment. 
But the main point is, in these games, you can keep making fast return of investment and keep reinvesting and compound it and, you know, make more and more, which could attract a lot of people into investing it in first. The price goes up. Everyone is, uh, you know, reinvesting, building. But then you reach a point where the majority of people already reinvested and just want to take money out now. So there's more people taking money out than joining in. So the price goes down, much like bomb crypto. It had the same shit. You could reinvest, you can get more champs, more accounts, earn more money. And then once you're satisfied, you just start dumping all of it. Also, this one has $10,000 in the liquidity pool which is extremely low so uh, I don't know how this is gonna work out oh this one's 600 already what the fuck hey hey oh yeah because the price went down <laughs> so it's more expensive anyway I'll keep these two for now this is basic oh well wait no I can't all right anyway uh, I'm gonna keep these two I'm gonna harvest it for a few days do the same as shit reinvest it to get all these as well probably keep reinvesting into another account as well and you know we're gonna see where the whole game and the price goes and what their marketing is because you have to get a lot of people to join in early and keep building their houses for the price to go you know not down at least and for the liquidity pool to have more liquidity because ten thousand dollars is I think the lowest I have seen on any crypto game so I'm not sure what's going on there but uh we'll see I mean yeah that's uh, that's that's basically it I guess right yeah yeah see you in the uh, update video I guess <laughs> fucking shit ass outros